All right, gang. Gather around. What is it, Mr. B? Yeah, what is it, Bob? Oh, don't tell me you guys forgot about today. Any oh, oh, I know, I know. Ask me, please, I know. Ask me. Anyone else aside from Benny? <sighs> All right, Benny. What day is it today? Why, today is the annual fruit festival. We do a huge party on the restaurant every year. Oh, I forgot about that. Oh, heavens, me too. Well, I'm sure this party is much better than last year's, right? Well, uh, I need all of you to put your fruits in these baskets. You guys want fruits, right? Uh, no. Oh, heavens, what are we gonna do? Oh, no! Is the fruit festival cancelled, Mr. B? Oh, you dumb salamanders. Important. Hell, I couldn't help but notice you guys need fruits real quick. My barn's filled with all kinds of fruits. Say, why don't you guys do me a small favor and I'll give you all the fruits you need. Yes! Barn adventure! I love barns! I want to see the pigs and the chickens and the animals and the barns and the pigs! Alright, Pete. We'll help. That'll be fun. All of us working. Really? What? Well, what do we for me? Uh, see, I told you this game was a little broken. I can tell. You know, I keep thinking about bunny smiles. It sounds so familiar. This game is bringing back so many memories, but it's so hard to just remember exactly. Ah. Uh. Sorry, um, probably just boring you with random thoughts of mine. I'll stop. No, 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 not at all, Sophie. However, I do, uh... I gotta do some other stuff. I got this one essay I need to finish. I'll see you around. Oh, alright. Just talk to me in case you have any questions regarding the game, okay? Yeah, yeah, sh Hi, Barn. Wait, shouldn't you be in the barn with the rest of the gang? Yeah, everything perfect. I'm supposed to solve this party, but most of the stuff I need is located in the ridiculously complex puzzles. Say, could you help me out to solve the puzzles? Alright, first we need to get the party hats. They should be in the big Alright, good track. Now we need to <coughs> this. Alright, first we need to get the party hats. They should be in the basement. There we go. What's that? Jenny? I give you. Okay, so, first of all, do not open the cages unless I tell you to. What would it be funny if I open the cage? I think it would be really funny. I think it would be really, really funny. Yeah, I think I'm gonna open the cage now. Yeah. Bunny. Uh, I'm... I'm sorry. 
I was just trying to help. It looks like they each entered a different door. We'll have to find keys for each door. BSI Techno Support Audio Log Number 3, uh, June 30th, 1974. Germany's birthday party finished an hour ago. I decided to stay and help the employers clean the place. This week has uh, been uh, strange, especially because of the opening. Uh, I find it weird that they opened the place even though Mr. Wharton disappeared a few weeks ago. I uh, hope he's doing alright. Rosemary came in today and asked if we'd seen him around. Uh, I'm pretty worried about it. Felix seems very concerned and worried too. Uh, uh, the birthday party, uh, the birthday party, yes. Uh, everything went according to plan. Uh, this was the first birthday party in the restaurant, and I feel it turned out pretty well. Uh, I noticed a few irregularities in the stage and in the audio animatronics. As the engineer and the person who basically built the animatronics to begin with, it was easier to notice these, uh, it, especially in Bonn. Uh, something, something fell off. Uh, the limbs weren't moving properly. They looked stiff and odd, mainly in his right arm. It took a few more minutes to take him to the backstage, just to make sure everything's okay. I'm the only one left. Uh, Chris left some hours ago, and Felix didn't even show up. I'll leave and close the restaurant when I'm finished. I'm sure it's not going to take long. What a wonderful surprise! I'm supposing you're here to help me set up Lily's birthday party, right? <laughs> wonderful! You see, I need someone to help me set up the games for the party. Say, why don't you help me set up the games? What do you think? Fantastic! Well, what are we waiting for? Let's get started. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, step right up. Get ready for entertainment like you've never seen before. Start with something simple. Memorize. Take a close look at this picture. Time's up. Let's play. Congratulations! You're very good at this. Right. It's time for the real game. Let's play Spot the Differences! <laughs> this one's a... Nope. That's not nope. the difference. That's not the difference. Congratulations! You completed my, my game! Now, I'm for the prize. This place is so beautiful. Hi, Vaughn. Didn't expect to see you here. What are you doing here? 
Oh, I just really wanted to check on you and see if everything is all right. Oh, that's so sweet from you. However, I already finished my task, but you can stick around if you want. How about we play a game? That oh, sounds fun. What would you like to play? What about hide and seek? Oh, I love that game. I'll hide. Great. This is going to be fun. <laughs> You found me. That was nice. I had so much fun playing with you. How about you had me? beautiful to you, Sophie. Uh, I know you found you. Oh. <laughs> uh, uh, Come all, welcome to my magic fountain of memories. Step right up and enter your most repressed experiences and get ready to be amazed by my magic. Let's take a small trip down memory lane, shall we? Tell me, what is it you would like to remember? There was nothing. <laughs> My old house. Hello, I Bob. I'm so glad you're here to help me clean the car maze. All that's left to do is change. I was wondering if you could give me a rose a small favor tonight. Oh, I, I don't know, Jack. Today's been nice. It's, it's, it's about uh, an emoli. They have a school event tonight. A school party and they have no one to pick them up. I need to stay at the workshop to finish the paperwork and Rose is um, taking Sophie to the dentist. We were wondering if you could pick them up for the event and take them home later. Tonight? Yeah, if it's possible, of course. <laughs> sure, I can do that. Really? Yeah, sure. Oh, thanks a lot, man. You're, you're a lifesaver, Felix. 
<laughs> it's nothing. Alright, so, can't believe you mark that 5 and get the home at 9. Rose should be home by then. If she's not, you call me. Got it? Got it. I remember this conversation. Be wary, for this memory seems to be buried deep within your mind. You must find them, Sophie. Left till we get home. Not much. Just, just kind of lost. I think. Uncle Felix, what are you drinking? M Y Q. Our teacher says drinking is not right. No, no, no. I'm just. I'm, I'm just. I'm just I'm just feeling dizzy. It's, it's not that big of a deal, alright? Oh, Molly, we're, we're almost there. Don't you think you're driving too fast? Listen, I'm just... Uh, I'm just trying to get you to... I'm just trying to get you to home quickly, alright? Look, I'm, I'm sorry, I just, I'm not feeling too good right now, I really just, just, I just want to lay in the bed and go to sleep. It's alright, we get that today wasn't the best for you, we understand, everything is gonna be okay. <laughs> Thanks Molly.
alone that night. He buried them here. He was too scared. But they found a way out eventually. Five new messages. Felix, pick up the phone. Now, I need you to pick up the phone. It's been three hours since I told you to get Ed and Molly home. What happened to my children? If anything happened, Felix, you must tell me. You haven't told me in three hours. I need to know what's going on. I'm trying to call you all night. What the hell is wrong with you? I... I've been trying to contact you all night. I've been calling everyone for you. But what the hell is wrong with you? Three hours, you didn't call. I asked you to do one simple favor for me. I need to know, where are they? Where did you... But that's not all, is it? There's still something you forgot to remember. They've been waiting for you.